It's the International Women's Day, and the efforts of these women are laid out for the world to see. Some of the exporters are looking at expanding their horizons beyond the shores of Africa. They are wherever seeking for policies that will help their businesses to thrive. I'm looking beyond just sending, in to in, sending my things to individuals. would want access to bigger markets where we can actually stock our products in other stores. They should make the requirement, the, the requirement to get in finance easier for us to assist us. Done with the tour of the product, officials of the Nigerian Export Promotion Council return to the hall to celebrate the women's contribution to the growth of the nation's non-oil sector, despite the challenges staring them in the face. The Council's quest to increase the participation of women in non-oil export led to the launch of the Women in Export Development Program in 2017. Through this program, NABC created a Women in Export Unit and assigned women desk officers to provide support services for the 3,610 female exporters who are currently registered with the Nigerian Export Commercial Council, as well as other women entrepreneurs who are interested in non-oil export. In 2022, non-oil exports rose to $4.82 billion, representing an increase of 39% compared to what was received in 2021. The council says that will increase with the increased certification of more female-owned export businesses. You may wish to know that the council has partnered with various private and public sector organizations over the years to provide better trade opportunities for women. One of such successful partnerships is with the International Trade Center, ITC, on the implementation of the She Trade Initiative in Nigeria that has been mentioned by one of the speakers. The business ecosystem is riddled with challenges that hinder the export of products from Nigeria. However, the promises made to these women by NEPC would possibly make it easier to thrive in efforts to get made in Nigeria products to the world.